Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today is Foundation Friday and I'm going to do it a little differently because my makeup is already on and I'm just gonna get directly into the foundation. I'm not going to talk your ear off and show you how the foundation applies but it's gonna be faster than most Foundation Fridays because I am on a roll today filming. So today's foundation is the NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation. I have just discovered this, this is not new um, I was just on the hunt for a new foundation and I have tried almost every foundation at Sephora or a high-end foundation that is obviously in my budget. I have tried the Makeup Forever Stick Foundation, which I hated. I have tried the Makeup Ultra HD Foundation, which is nice but doesn't have enough coverage for me at the moment because I have so much acne scars. I have tried the Becca Foundation in the small tube, which I don't really like how it looks on my skin. I used to, but my skin has changed so I don't like it as much anymore. I'm in the process of testing another foundation out. I have tried the the Naked Skin and it's alright. It's like a good foundation for a day-to-day -day basis. I've just tried a bunch of foundations and this has got to be my go-to for the moment. I have fallen in love with this one. I am still testing out foundations because I want to find more than one foundation that I really love. But this one, this one has a dear place in my heart. I've been trying it out for a month now and I love it and I wanted to sh come to you guys and just tell you what I think about the foundation. This is the original packaging and then this is the packaging and hello it has a pump. It has a pump. We all love foundations with a pump. It's just easier. You make less messes and it's just convenient especially when you're traveling. The foundation comes with your standard one fluid ounce. Sephora describes it as an oil-free foundation that delivers full natural looking coverage with one drop or lightweight 16 hour wear. And it's perfect for all skin type. It features weightless long wear technology and exclusive blend from NARS with flexible polymers and treated pigments that move with the skin with providing 16 hours of staying power. That's quite a mouthful. The foundation comes in 20 shades. And I know that NARS foundation tend to run a little bit more yellow, which I personally love because I have more of a yellow undertone. I am neutral, but I tend to lean towards more yellow than a peachy tone. Um, this one is half a shade off, like literally less than half, but I like it because I can just blend it down my neck. It's nothing too crazy like other foundations where I have to even blend it down to my chest. Um, this is the closest foundation I have that matches my skin tone and i really really love that i've been waiting and looking and searching for a foundation that i feel comfortable with wearing my hair up with without having to drag it in all different places and blend it down to like right here and this is the one i actually started by getting samples from my job just to see how it wore and the first day i wore it my manager was like what foundation do you have on it looks really good and that's when i knew that this is the foundation for me and i kept using it and i love the way my makeup applies and I love the way that it wears throughout the day. Um, it does give you like a luminosity to the skin, but it's nothing too crazy. Your skin just looks really healthy. If I want to stay more matte in certain areas, I will set with my Laura Mercier powder right here. I usually use the RCM Mano Color Powder, but it's not as mattifying as the Laura Mercier one. Um, I am transitioning into oily skin. My skin is weird. For um, the warmer months, my skin is drier. For the colder months, my skin is oilier. Um, I don't have a problem with it. I just have to learn to work with different products. But this one was good when my skin was dry and it's working even better when my skin is oily. I don't have any issues with this foundation. Some people don't like it too much because of the undertones. But if you have a yellow undertone, you will find your match. They do such a good job, you know, providing colors with people with yellow undertones, which I really love. And they have a good variety of shades, which I love. The price point is $48. It is pricey, but it's worth it. A little bit goes a long way. I literally take half a pump and I rub it with my fingers and I start working it into my skin. Then I go on with a brush to blend it out. And then I go on top with a beauty blender. You don't have to do all those steps. That's just something that works for me. And a little does go a long way. It layers beautifully. You can build the coverage if it, this is not full coverage for you. I personally have some acne scars that I like to cover. Prior to finding this foundation, I would have to go with the Kat Von D concealer, which you guys know that is a heavy concealer, then go on top with my foundation on top of color correcting and all these things. With this, I literally just use this. Maybe if I don't want to, you know, layer the foundation, I'll go and like spot conceal. I have one blemish that is 
a pain in the butt to conceal but aside from that this covers everything everything i love this foundation and i was watching some reviews because i like to um get other people's perspectives with other um skin types to let you guys know how it works i know people with oily skin that love this foundation i have dry skin and i love it my skin is transitioning to a little bit oily and i still love it this is an amazing foundation i recommend and i will always recommend you going to sephora getting matched and getting a sample because foundations are expensive especially when they're high-end and it's really annoying because I've done it to buy a foundation and keep it and never wear it that's $50 that you literally just threw away so yeah this is definitely worth the price for me it's $48 it's expensive but it is so good and I know that I'm gonna get a lot of use out of it because like I said I've been looking for that one foundation that I know I'm gonna love and wear all the time and this is definitely it I love it. You need it. You need to try it. Let me know if you guys try it or if you guys loved it. I've used it with the Benefit Professional and the NARS Primer that covers the pores. And I like it better with the NARS Primer. I also use the NARS Concealer. I just feel like NARS is a great product. It's one. I think it might be my favorite high-end brand. And I don't know why it took me so long to try this out. Because I've always loved the concealers. And now I love the foundation. So... That is my review. I hope it helped you guys. I am in the color Tahoe, by the way. Um, I hope that helps. I'm also at NC44 in MAC. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what other foundations you guys want to see me review. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.